Hello and welcome to part two of my vlog from Las Vegas and NAB 2016. Now you may be thinking, this is very green. The scenery looks different to the first part and I'm sure the car was red where you'll be very astute and very correct. I'm now in Park City, Utah and I've got uh, a few more days in the States before I go home. And it is the complete opposite in so many ways to Vegas. Six camera spherical array. The critical thing about it is it's actually synchronized. A lot of the arrays that are on the market today, they're using Hero 4s already, but they're not synchronized. Synchronization is really critical because what happens is all these cameras, they'll get fired at the same time, all the settings will actually go at the same time. There are Hero Bus connectors going to each of these cameras, and that allows us to drive the settings and the start stop from all the cameras driven by one primary master camera. Uh, the rig goes for 5000 as an all-inclusive package with cameras, stitching software, uh, cases, batteries, or it can be purchased as a rig-only option. Uh, if you already have your four black cameras, the rig is the synchronizing rig, the frame itself, a case, uh, and a few tools to go with it. And how much is that? So that's 15, 1500 US dollars. Oh. You really have to, you really call it batteries? No, I'm awfully harsh. I call it Batis. I call it Batis. Oh, well, you're I'm half French. French so, yeah, that's why. This is the new Batis, 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 whatever you want to call it. As long as you buy them, you call it what you like. 18mm, like. and uh, I have the uh, 24 and the 85, and they're both beautiful. This belongs on my camera. You can't ask me that question. Okay. Have you seen how hairy Steve Weiss's back is? I have not seen how hairy Steve Weiss's back is. But if anybody would know, look at look at look at Joe's now. face and imagine that on Steve Weiss's back. <laughs> That's what his back is like. Come on, I mean, you gotta fucking be kidding me. It's okay. It's wider than you think. I mean, no, 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 no. I can't have anything near my old face like that. It's okay. It's, it's, it's 4K. It would be nice. It, 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 is it 4K? I'm shooting Okay, HD. that is ridiculous, dude. It's like, I need to see that before you put that out there. Sure. I my face wide, and you like that. I know. Wow, can can you like tell really me close, in 60 seconds what we have here? Go. No, I can't. Just try and I'll cut it out. We have an old guy behind the camera who's. Uh, you're older. You're ten years older than me. I know, but I'm getting younger. You don't like understand. An critics are I keep getting younger. It, what? You like your brain is like regressing? No, my brain's getting older, but my body and everything. I'm working on making. Yeah, that. but it's all that. You know, plastic surgery is not good for you. Well, cool you, sculpting is good. The, I don't look, go for the plastic surgery, but the cool You're going to end up looking like Janet Jackson soon if you're not careful. No, 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 no. You no. will. Real quick, here it is. So it's an Anton wood grip. It's got a back strap. Got one cable that goes to the control box. Control box has three motor controllers, uh, some limos for power, D-taps for power. Uh, it'll eventually have a, a Z drive, an electronic Z drive. Let's look at the grip. You got your zoom control here. You got your camera control for all your different cameras here. Full joystick, programmable buttons. You got a go button, you got a pre-programmable button, you got iris control, and this is your gradical joystick. It has three programmable buttons, total menu control, gradical, and cameras. And what does it work with? Which oh, cameras? Check this out here. Do you want to set it on the ground? Boom. Nice. Yeah, I think you want that. So which, which cameras will this work with? Every camera. Every camera? Yeah. Every, every camera that's got a remote input, I'm assuming. Every camera has a remote input. So it, this has LAN C, so it'll work with your, your uh, mirrorless cameras. Uh, the LAN C will work with your Canons and your Sonys. Right now, this is this is a prototype, obviously. Right. But it is working with Canons and Sonys. Can we have different type of wood? No. So I'm in my hotel room in, uh, in Vegas. Back here again. Last time I was here was in September, after just at the end of the filming of the uh, the Wanderlust Colorado River episode. What's exciting is this was waiting for me. I'm actually filming on an RX 100 uh, 4, but this is um, one that I've, I've got uh, modified for infrareds. 
There she is, infrared modified RX100 Mark IV. This has the super color filter in, and I've got some additional filters for some different looks. Driving a Shelby Mustang as well, and this is uh, automatic and it's got a very high clutch. A little bit different to the piece of cake Chevrolet that I was driving in Vegas, and uh, it's a hell of a lot faster. But as this is not my car and I'm borrowing it, not Ferris Bueller style, I have permission to borrow it. Uh, I still want to be very careful with it. So what are we seeing here? Uh, this is the X828C. So it's a Griffin Dynamics frame. It's got a useful load of 35 pounds. Uh, total takeoff weight is 62 pounds, but you can fly it within the 55 pound limit. That's the HD100. That's a 100 kilo takeoff weight. The payload is 154 pounds. And from prop guard to prop guard, it's about 12 feet across. 16 rows. I just want to go do 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 do. Seen the video of this where you completely, you know, hit everything with it. Are you not doing a live demo of the robustness of this? Uh, no, we're not, but I could. Do you have a bat? Do you have a. Do you have a baseball you have, bat? No, you're, you're Australian, you haven't got any. Any, Australia, got a, I got a cricket any Americans with guns here? Does anyone have a gun? <laughs> Lots Did of hands see, just went off. You see, we brought it. This is, oh, wow, this is the one you shot at. Yeah. So and it still works. So it's got a hole in it. Works. Yep. Just shot it there, too. Three, two, one. Yeah, I got that. Yeah. Here we go. Three, two, one. Smile, look up. Oh, there we go. And now we're stopped. So now I'll play that back for you. That is fast. Playing back. These wonderful shoes. Boom. Smile. <laughs> that was incredible. <laughs> Where's the battery cell phone? It's so cool, it spins. It's like a Chinese restaurant table. Up here? It is. It Put is. some chow mein on there. You want some? Are you filming people? No. Stand at your back. Hi, are you spotted by hidden camera? <laughs> like a creeper, he's like hiding in the bathroom. What's this guy? Oh, you can like. I'm sneakily filming you. <laughs> I, just hang, I just got it ready for you, so I just put it up, pointing it up a bit. Just, uh, Hello. Where are you from? You from CBP? I've heard of them. You will, darling. Very well. So I bought the, um, which length is it called? The one I bought, 24 inch. So I have a 24 inch, which is enough for me for one slider, for one tripod. That's, that's key for me with the slider. Center mounted uh, connector. What do you think? It's just, it's the smoothest. It's just, when you, you put the flywheel on there and you just move it with one finger and it just, effectively, I think the camera floats. The interface is just perfect. Wow. It's been programmed, I guess it's been programmed already to not hit the end. And there, it stops and so you can program repeatable moves and tell it to ramp as well at the end so it's it's smooth and, and I use it on the Wonderlist all the time for interviews going back and forwards and also for time lapse. Okay so, so what do we got on the controller here? Well at the moment this is just live motion so you can just uh, move it back and forward so it's, but you can also program a move here and you can tell it how to, how long it takes to go from one end uh, from the beginning to the end and then set it to repeat if you want to which is great for um, you know for interviews and stuff but and now we've got the Rhino Art coming which will keep the, the camera positioned so it's a move ahead and as the time lapse mode it's just the interface is so simple the battery is integrated in here and it lasts ages absolutely ages so yeah I just is this part of your kit these days it is and look this is nice there we go it's a lovely setup and the key thing for me is it's light and it's it, the setup is so quick I don't want to be faffing with like taking time if I'm going to use it I need to be, put it up straight away 
because it's a much noisier car, I'm recording my audio, which is what I should have done in the first place, using a lav mic going into my phone. I normally use the Rode Smart Lav Plus, but uh, uh, I left it in Vegas, actually, so it's being sent to me. I have my backup, which is the Sennheiser um, Apogee mic, uh, which is nice. It's lightning-based. Uh, it's very nice. Uh, better than the Rode? Eh, they're about the same. It's much more expensive, though. It does use the lightning, and it has its uh, the Apogee connection for the preamp, which is pretty good. Contrary to my advice that I gave in the vlog one, which is get there a bit early. Don't get there too early like I did. I was absolutely knackered before the show had even started. So the actual show itself is exhausting. And I went every day, but uh, I'm not sure. And I didn't even do that much partying, so I didn't really. Maybe I'm just getting old. So this is the Music Bed Film Supply Party in the Skyloft at MGM. It's not ostentate. Oh, Road as well. I'm sorry. Let me redo that. This is the Road slash Music Bed slash Film Supply Party at the MGM Skyloft. And there is Road there himself. How are you? <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. I haven't seen you for like two days. That's true. It has been. <laughs> Say something on camera. Oh, okay. Gentlemen, uh, Las Vegas is okay from this time. You seem better. It's really snobby, actually. It's a really snobby it's, thing to it's say. It's barely... Well, people can't afford to come up to these suites, like, like us, behind the camera. It's because they spent all the money on blowing hookers down on the streets. <laughs> so we're going in, too. You know you're in a nice hotel when... There's a Ferrari and McLaren on the back side. Nice to meet you. Hi. I read your blog every day. Every day? I only update it like twice a month. It's an honor to meet you here. Thank you very much. It was great to meet loads of people. I did a talk about the wonder list. All these people are going to be so disappointed. Oh, and personally, I had about uh, uh, quite a lot of selfies taken with me, which was very flattering. But I have to be completely honest with you. I do find it a little bit embarrassing. I am, I, I'm, I'm a shooter. I'm a cameraman. I'm a DP. I'm a director. Whatever you want it is, I do this because I love to share and I love to shoot. Um, you may be asking, well, what are you doing on camera? Well, I've been asked to do stuff on camera. And I don't mind doing stuff on camera because I can put on a persona. The problem is in real life, you can put on a player to a certain amount, but I do find it a little bit exhausting. And I do find people wanting to take a photo with me a bit strange. That's because it's me and I'm just me, you know, nothing else. But, you know, if people want to say hello and, and shake my hand and take a selfie, then of course I'm enormously flattered. And, uh, I t you know, it's, of course you are, the, the downs, the problem is of course you, you, you could be quite busy. And, uh, and sometimes people want to do, do something with you and talk to you and you just don't have time. I wish I could. So what about the actual show? There was no real groundbreaking things. It must be one of the first shows, I think it's the first show in what, four years that Blackmagic haven't announced a camera? I mean, it doesn't help that last year they announced the 4.6K and it's only really starting to ship now. I don't think I had anything that I would call my favorite thing at the show. Um, I got to try quite a lot of really nice things. Um, but there's not one thing that I will say is memorable for this show, not one thing that I think I will go, oh, that was the year of. But uh, as a show as a whole, I think it was a good experience because of the whole lots of things to see, lots of new things to see. Hi, Eddie from Good Yeah, yeah, how are you? Nice to see you. Nice to long time, nice <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I'm so lost. So, I'm trying to find aperture. Uh, Ten six four eight. So it's going to be along here somewhere. Oh, I think they're right over there, hidden behind Sony. That might make sense. Somebody told me they're on the edge. No. Yeah. I've been walking around for ages trying to find them. How are you? Ready. I have to run. I've got to try. I'm so late. Good to see you. Nice to see you. Thanks for all the things for uh, November as well. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Hi, how are you? Great job on the raffle last night. All right, thank you very much. Cheers. Thank you. Hi. I'm Lucy. Hi, Lucy. That we've met. Yeah, how are you? Nice to see you. Good. Mwah. 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 <laughs> Look what I've got on me. It's great seeing you. Thank you, thank you very much. Cheers. You too. Bye.
Why is that? I know film's cool, pay to pixel, and film light at the best light of the year. Yeah. It's been on all day, you can touch it. Yeah, that's not bad, is it? How do I know it's been on all day? Uh, I'll well, take, take your word for it, right? I'll take a picture tomorrow. I'll I want a time a lapse of it. Live stream with video. a clock next to it going round. <laughs> we'll have a guy with a live stream video just sitting here saying, oh, holding what? it, holding it We're without gloves. <laughs> that's what you need to do. <laughs> that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. Um, 1K output, it's smaller than 1K? Astro. Yeah, you want to see it? Here we go. Output on something smaller is density. Yeah. So we pack those LEDs in tighter. Normally there's a heat problem when you do that. Mm -hmm. We take all the guts of the light off, put them down, now it's a bottom heavy light. That's a big camera on a big rig. Can you pick that up? Yeah. How long can you hold that? Um, I'll find out. Let's find out, okay. And we're gonna start the stopwatch. Wait, 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 wait. And we're off. Hold it. Oh, he's moving, no, no, you, gotta, you can't run away with it. You have to stay here and hold okay. it. Don't drop it. How's the sweat? Is there any sweat on his forehead yet? Uh, How heavy do you think that is? Light. Pretty light, he's getting cocky. Okay, that's 20 seconds. Doing well. Okay, I can see some switching there, can you? Maybe I should put this on a tripod, this is getting tiring for me <laughs> holding this. You're okay still, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's doing well. GT, two, yeah. one minute so far he's held it. No, no, I'm just gonna put, I'm just gonna put the camera down, there we go. Yes, tickle him, it. tickle him, tickle under his arm, tickle his feet. He's doing really well though, I'm really impressed. Oh my god, look at the shaking now. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Now we're seeing it, the pressure, the pressure. Look at that, muscles are twitching. Oh my god, he's not going to make it. Oh, you're at two minutes, ten seconds. You could do it. Four seconds. Three, two, one. Well done. Three minutes. Well done. Yeah, I'll have a go. Yeah, okay. that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop that. Forget that. <laughs> That's too heavy. I'm not picking that up. Every time I'm at NAB, I always say, "That's it. That's the last time." And well, for a while. At least I'm not going to go next year. I'm going to take a year off. I say that every single time. I've been eight years running. I'm not going to go next year. Take a year off.